We're in an abandoned railroad crossing on the abandoned CNCIAC sub. Look how just bad these tracks have been. They've been abandoned since at least 2015. The last time a train was down here was 2016. But this hasn't been a train since. Here's the milepost number 217.90D. And right here, if you look hard, it does say Illinois Central Railroad. Right here. This road crossing system has been deactivated. And the light is not on. It's not on. That's my dad over there. He's just walking, looking at the rails, tying the shoes. Here's one signal. A bunch of safe train stuff. However, the crossbacks are newer though. They're probably newer than the signals themselves. And then there's the other signal on a very weird kind of part. As you can see, that's literally, it looks like it's going to fall down. You can see on that gap right there. Safe Tran E Bell, probably a Type 2, maybe even a Type 1. We have this little creek right here. And here's where the Crown 3 mine is down there where the Crown 3 used to be open. The trains would circle around the mine after dropping and collecting coal. They would come out, come out over here, circle the mine, come back. That's how it went. The tracks are actually a bit shiny, they're not 100% abandoned, as I said, but. You see, and when I contacted CN, they were like, the tracks are rarely used. They're never used as much. So it's technically, pretty much they said that the status is discontinued for the subdivision. This is a three mile walk, by the way. Here's another look at the crossing. Just in bad shape. There are like every three years, a weed train will come down here and spray off the weeds if there is any, but there isn't. I'm gonna go ahead and pause the video and I'll give a status where I'm at later on. If you wanna know how bad these tracks are, most track, most of these are like missing these real nails right here. They can come out way too easily. And then there's the crossing again. And now we're gonna walk over to the mine like I said. We went fishing before. I got a cramp in my leg and I don't wanna restrain it. So here's another look down the crossing very spooky look down the line with the crown three back there with my dad sorry about that just neglected everything's like neglected you can see the broken tie right here oil gravel coal I mean look at this right here just oil hot oil and just coal and gravel and stuff look at this right here just all gravel I don't know what this wire's doing here, but me and my dad believe that it used to toggle the signals. But there are no like trackside signals, you know, the ones that turn red, yellow, and green. But there's the crossing down there. We've definitely walked a long mile, or a long way down. But yeah, these are just there. We're getting closer, and we're coming up two signs. One right here, one over there. Here's a uh, rail nail here. Oh well, it's a bit crooked. I'm not gonna take it, just leave it, and it's all rusty and stuff too. Just a whistle post for the crossing down there. You can see how bad and crooked they are. It's just sad, and neglected. You can see how skinny these tracks are. They're not really, you know, tall and, you know, cut like the ones in the UP Gillette, Jelliet. They're just sitting here like this, never to be used again. Just extremely sad. This is where the oil and the coal start to really come out. Like, look at that. That's just covered. Some trains used to come through here, but that's not a thing anymore. Mile post 220. Right here. This is the, uh, more of the line. This is the second part of the video. Here's the mile post 220. Down there, it was 219 point some 70D, I think. There's a turtle right here. I wonder what this little guy's doing here. He's you probably should... stuck. He can't get on the other side. You probably shouldn't be out there, little boy. You just put him in there. Yeah. You good turtle. It's just weird seeing a turtle in abandoned tracks. I just noticed that. Got inside the tracks and can't get out. That's sad for him. I like turtles. That's a dead meme. Brief, be free, little turtle. I'm sorry. There's big now right here. Stuck. Okay, it's a big nail. Probably for one of those parts, yeah. 
right here you can see where the part was missing. Oh well. That was coal. Yeah, I remember that. We you found, found your room. Yeah, we found brake pads over here and I should I remember should tie this. Look at all this coal just sitting here. Just eerie. We're getting even closer with this bunch of these Oh my god, it's too green. Too green for me, boys. Getting even closer. You can see where the tracks curve where they were going to the mine. We're really getting close now. It's a wild turkey somewhere. Oh, hopefully he doesn't attack us like that one guy did in that one commercial Thanksgiving like two years ago. Down there, it's, it's gorgeous, like really gorgeous. The turkey's somewhere around here. This is probably part of a break, and they're just throwing railroad ties out in the ditch. It's just sad how it's seen them. And down there, there's actually a pile of them somewhere. Just sad. This metal bar right here, I almost tripped on this. Weird. We're on the curve right now, and there's the mine. So we're getting even closer. Here's the old knuckle that me and my dad found like th four years ago when we came here for the first time. And it still sits here getting even rustier. It's really cool. Well, here we are, the end of the line. Where the tracks used to be, and where they still are today. Nothing has changed since my last video of coming up here. Just too spooky. And here's the mine of over here, and here's where the trains used to go through. We might walk up there, we don't know. We just hope that nobody's here. Here we are. There's the mine where the hole where the train used to go through, and there's the junction where it used to be. Well, pretty much it for this video and there's where the tracks end. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. I'll see you guys later. Peace. I went ahead and I'll show you guys this real quick, but if you look over there at the mine, it's actually starting to cave in. It's going to be tore down and then those are where the trains used to go. There's still tracks that are under there, believe it or not. But just look at all this machinery. It just sits here. Abandoned. Never to be used again. They've got, you know, dump trucks like that right there, excavators, you know, plow, bulldozers, all this stuff. And then look, like I said, that's beginning to cave in right there. And the water tower is behind that right there. And like I said, that's where the trains that used to go in. There. But yeah, it's starting to become a cave in right there. And then where I'm standing is where the train used to be. And you can see my dad over there where the tracks are gone. They just end there. And those are where the tracks would split up. The trains, or first the trains would come through here, through there, through there, get the coal, come around, through here, and back away. And this is where the CIA C sub is gone. Nowhere to be seen. Oh crap, there's some, I'm just kidding, there's not some here. Um, but yeah, thanks for guys, thank you guys so much for watching. I might come back here in maybe a couple more years if I get my own car. I don't know, it depends. These will be demolished soon, believe me, they will be. But thank you guys so much for watching, I'll see you guys later. Peace.